Welcome to the open house for the State Road 50 widening design project for segments Dash 2 and Dash 3 from east of State Road 35 or US 301 to east of County Road 478A in Hernando and Sumter counties. The purpose of this open house is to present the proposed design to the public and to give residents and interested persons an opportunity to review the project displays and other information and discuss the project with the project team, ask questions, and provide comments. Public participation is encouraged and solicited without regard to race, color, religion, sex, age, national origin, disability, or family status. Persons wishing to express their concerns about Title VI may do so by contacting either the Florida Department of Transportation District 5 Office, District 7 Office, or the Tallahassee Office. This contact information is also provided on a sign displayed near the sign-in table. A Project Development and Environment, or PD&E, study completed in June 2019 evaluated alternatives for four segments of State Road 50, labeled Dash 2 through Dash 5 on the map, from U.S. 301 in Hernando County to County Road 33 in Lake County. All four of the segments studied are currently under design. The purpose of this project is to improve safety on State Road 50, as well as increase capacity throughout the corridor. This project is part of a greater effort addressing existing and future congestion and delay, improving safety and traffic flow, and allowing the State Road 50 corridor to operate at an improved level of service for all users. The corridor's context were also considered to accommodate bicycles and pedestrians. The need for the project is based on six primary factors, system linkage, roadway capacity, legislation or plan consistency, modal interrelationships, safety, and hurricane evacuation. This open house is for two segments. 435859-2 from east of State Road 35 or US 301 and ending at the Hernando Sumter County line in Hernando County and 435859-3 beginning at the Hernando Sumter County line and ending just east of County Road 478A in Sumter County a combined distance of approximately eight miles. The existing typical section includes one 12 foot wide travel lane in each direction with a four foot wide paved outside shoulder. There are no inside shoulders and no median to separate opposing lanes of traffic. The proposed typical section has two 12-foot wide travel lanes in each direction, 8-foot wide shoulders on the inside, and 10-foot wide shoulders on the outside. There is a 40-foot wide median that separates opposing lanes of traffic. Segment Dash 3 has a 12-foot wide shared use path on the eastbound side of the road, separated by a grass swale and segment dash two has a 10 foot wide shared use path on the eastbound side, separated by a grass swale. There will be two bridges over the CSXT railroad, one traveling westbound, the other eastbound. Each bridge will have two 12 foot wide travel lanes, a 10 foot wide paved outside shoulder, and a six foot wide paved inside shoulder. The eastbound bridge will have a 12 foot wide shared use path on the outside, separated by a barrier. 
The Little Withlacoochee River Bridge is located 2.3 miles south of County Road 478A, near the Hernando Sumter County line. The existing bridge will be modified to carry two westbound lanes of traffic. A parallel bridge will be constructed to carry the eastbound lanes. The new bridge will match the existing bridge. It will accommodate two 12-foot wide travel lanes with a 12-foot wide shared use path on the outside. Proposed roadway improvements include access management improvements will reduce the number of conflict points or potential crash locations in some areas. An overpass for the Florida Trail will make it safer for trail users. A shared use path along the eastbound side of the roadway will make it safer for bicycles and pedestrians. A new parallel bridge will be built over the Little Withlacoochee River. This will separate the lanes of traffic and make it safer for vehicles crossing the river. Proposed roadway and safety improvements include additional traffic lanes will lessen traffic backup and congestion and allow better emergency vehicle access. The highway will be divided with a grassed median to improve safety. Head-on collisions with vehicles traveling in the opposite direction will be less likely. Increased design speed will improve traffic flow. An overpass for the CSXT Railroad will eliminate the at-grade crossing. Drainage improvements are being designed to minimize impacts to the Withlacoochee State Forest. Along with five stormwater treatment ponds, retention areas and swales along the roadside and in the median will collect stormwater. Closed stormwater conveyance systems, such as pipes, will also be utilized in areas where the water needs to be conveyed to the ponds. Environmental and wildlife improvements are being designed to minimize impacts to the Withlacoochee State Forest and the surrounding wetlands. Six new culverts will be constructed to allow safe passage for wildlife from one side of the road to the other. A new pedestrian underpass for Florida Trail users will also allow pedestrians safe passage under the road. The project team will continue to coordinate with Hernando and Sumter County's emergency responders throughout project design and construction. The public hearings for the Project Development and Environment, or PD&E, study were held on November 27th and November 29th, 2018. The State Environmental Impact Report, or SEER, was finalized in June 2019. The project is currently at Phase 2, or 60% plans. This will be the only public meeting for State Road 50, Segments Dash 2 and Dash 3, during the design phase. Design is anticipated to be complete in late spring of 2020. The project is funded for right-of-way and construction. Right-of-way acquisition is anticipated to be complete in spring of 2021. Construction is anticipated to begin in late 2021 or early 2022. The estimated costs for this project are design for segment dash two is 4.5 million, for segment dash three, 3.7 million. Right of way for segment dash two is 3.5 million, for segment dash three, 5.9 million. Construction for segment dash two is 49.5 million. For segment dash three, 25 million.
For more information about State Road 50, Segment-2 in Hernando County, type this website link into your web browser. This link is also on a sign at the sign-in table. For more information about the State Road 50-3 segment in Sumter County, please visit www.cflroads.com. You are encouraged to visit this website, which contains the links to easy access to online information and to stay current with the status of the project. Once you have accessed the project website, you will be able to view the current project schedule details, project contact information, and access project files such as this presentation. Type the project number 435859-3 in the search box at the top of the page, then click on Go. When the new page opens, click on the project file name. We encourage you to share your comments with us. There are many different ways you can submit your comments. Share your comments with a member of the project team. Fill out a comment form and drop it in the comments box at the comments table. Take a comment form with you and mail it to the address shown on the form. Email your comments to one of the FDOT project managers. District 7, Hernando County, Kevin Lee at kevin.lee at dot.state.fl.us or District 5, Sumter County, Jude Jean Francois, jude.jean-francois at dot.state.fl.us or submit your comments online. For the State Road 50-2 segment in Hernando County, type the link into your web browser. When the page comes up, click on the Send a Comment or Ask a Question button. For the State Road 50-3 segment in Sumter County, click on the Ask a Question button on the CFL Roads website under the Project Manager's Contact Information. All comments received by November 25, 2019 will become part of the official public record for this meeting. If you have questions or would like more information, you may contact either of the FDOT project managers, FDOT District 7, Hernando County-2 segment, Kevin Lee or FDOT District 5, Sumter County-3 segment, Jude Jean Francois. Thank you for your interest in this project and for taking time to attend this open house. This presentation will begin again in approximately one minute.